Hi guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. We are sat on the floor today because why not? I don't know, I'm just, I keep sitting on the floor quite a lot recently and I'm finding it very comfortable. I don't know why, but yeah, so I'm filming on the floor. <laughs> you didn't really need to know that, but it is what it is. Anyway, so today's video is going to be a tiny little bit different. So I kind of got this like, idea from watching Zoe Suggs, Zoe Suggs even, <laughs> vlog the other day where basically her and Joe were going through their like school report cards. So I have, it's kind of, I was going to do that but then I was trying to find the reports and I came across something actually different. It's honestly, I actually forgot I had this but now I've seen it I kind of remember it but I can't remember what's in it. Now, I thought my school reports were going to be in my memory box that my mum and dad did for me growing up as like a child. And I came across this item in there. So, we're going to go through it and it's a little bit different. So, I mean, I don't know how well this is going to go with my channel. But hey ho, it's something that I want to do. So, we're going to go ahead and do it. So, yeah. <laughs> so, this is what I came across. And, oh my god, I actually don't know how this is going to go down because I actually can't remember what's in it and obviously if there's any personal stuff in that I'm not going to show it because yeah but yeah let's get into the video <laughs> now you are probably wondering what have I come across but then again it might be the title of this video so yes so this is what I've come across so it basically says it's clear right this is how I wrote my name this is how like little I was how young and I've also decorated it and if you can't read it it says Sarah here and it says time capsule not to be opened until June 2009 which I'm pretty sure is when I finished high school I'm pretty sure I was class of 09 in high school <sighs> I sound so old now but yeah so this was obviously before I went into college and yeah, I remember, I rem actually remember opening it when I like finished high school and I actually remember being quite shocked about one item in there. That's the only like item that I remember. So we're going to go ahead and open it. It's quite bulky so there's definitely something in it and it kind of jingles as well. I genuinely can't remember everything that's in this. I can only remember one thing and it's something that I think is, I don't know. I just remember one thing because I was mortified. Oh my God, there's a news article in here. What's this news article? Was I in the paper? What is this news article? One second. Was my school in the paper? I'm confused. <laughs> I need to figure this out now. Is it just basically the year of this? Because, wait a minute. June 1999 guys, what the heck? Right, why have I got, have I just got this paper for the date? I'm a bit confused. I'm like literally reading every like article heading to see if it's anything that's like related to me in any way. I think it might just be the date just to show the date of when it was. Yeah, I think it, I think it was literally just the date because there's nothing in there that I can see that's related to me. But literally, can you see the date on there? How crazy is that? That was in June 1999 paper. What the heck? Honestly, that this just sums up the front the front piece of paper just sums up what city I lived in. <laughs> so bad. Anyway, I'm pretty sure that is just because it was 1999 and it was the day. I'm that's that's all I can think of. Right, next we have this piece of paper and 11 for the second 99 my clothes. Why is it ripped? Oh, there's something on the back. When changing plasticine, when I made a worm, I had to twist the plasticine I used. Appling action. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, I was such an innocent little kid. Anyway, that's my handwriting. This says my clothes. What the heck does that say? Glass stock. 
What? Check my clothes for a cold outside. I don't know what that says. I had rubbish hand. I still have rubbish hand right now. I've got woolly hat, but it just says wool. Wool. Lee. Plastic. I mean, I don't really understand that, but I got a tick. So it was really good work and they even put a good try. I tried my best, guys. But this is my little picture of me with my outfit on for a was it a cold yeah a cold day outside i don't know <laughs> i was the best drawer i promise you oh another drop thing this says my leisure clothes oh my god i have a big head a fire suit for playing fireman games that's what my teacher wrote i had a massive head i drew myself a massive head and i was red couldn't even tell you now this says this was 1998 this so this was when i was t t t this was when i was i was born in 93 94 95 96. i was five why have i gone blurred thank you i was five and this says then or now look through the book color red things used long ago color yellow things used now right the page number so i'm guessing i'm guessing we had like a book that we had to like do it from because obviously it's got page numbers in it but that's my coloring in when i was five <laughs> that's so cool cool i was just the best color -er, color -er, color i was the best person at coloring in when i was five i still can't color in the lines now i'm not gonna lie right what's next i'm just gonna dig in oh my god i know what this is as if we kept it oh my god what <laughs> there's so many things that i just felt i'm so confused <laughs> literally i'm so confused right so i remember this i actually know what this was for so this is my name right and i've i made this myself this s and obviously stuck it in and it's got the rest of my name there and this was actually it was like either i'm pretty sure it was on my peg for my coat and it was stuck up this is so cool that I, they put it in there for us to keep. That is actually like really cool. I don't know why I picked yellow because yellow, as far as I'm aware, yellow was never my favourite colour. But I mean, hey ho, it could have been when I was like, however old I was. But yeah, this is so cool that this they like put this in the time capsule because I actually remember it now I've seen it. It was so, so cool. And I, it's still in very good like condition as well. I might have to like put that up on my wall or something. But yeah, it's so cool. I actually love that and i remember making this as well i'm pretty sure it was like with um string and like paper mache or something and then i just colored it in and obviously we had to put a bit of glitter on there i don't know what my camera's focusing on behind me we obviously had to put a bit of glitter on there as well so that is next anyway next the thing that i was shocked at that just fell out because i'm like what the heck it's so tiny i cannot believe that they put this in here this is a little sock of mine. Look how small it is. I mean, I've got small feet now, but I don't, in fact, I reckon I could still fit with this in on my foot. Oh my God, shall I try it? I'm gonna try it. Do you reckon I'd still fit it in it? I still have small feet now. Oh my God, it still fits. It actually still fits. It fits perfect. What the heck? <laughs> that is actually so funny. That is too funny. As if that still fits me. <laughs> I have really small feet, guys. I'm only a size of like three and a half, four. Oh my God, that's too funny that it still fits. But I can't believe my mum actually let them keep a sock to put in a time capsule. But it's so tiny, but it still fits my foot. What the heck? Oh my God, this is the other thing that fell out at me when I got the, 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 the Serenade tag out. It's this little McDonald's toy. I don't know why that's in there. I literally don't remember this, but sh I must have been obsessed with it when I got it. <laughs> For them to put it in the time capsule. But yeah, who is it? It's Mr. Strong, because you know I'm so strong. <laughs> that was so cheesy. But yeah, Mr. Strong is in there. <laughs> I do remember these little McDonald's toys though, but I don't know why this one in particular is in my time capsule, but it's there. 
Right, next, let's dig in. I'm literally ripping the whole thing. Next, I think I've got, oh my God, this pictures. What the heck? Oh my God. This, right, I think, is that all the pictures? I think so, yeah, perfect, right. So, this was clearly my favorite band growing up and I still love them now. And there's a picture in there with them. So, <laughs> look at that, Spice Girls. Wait, why is it more than, oh, it's like double of them. I was confused and I was like, why is it more than like the amount that's in the band? But Spice Girls, I was obsessed with the Spice Girls. It actually says my favorite pop group, Spice Girls, on the back that my mum clearly wrote. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. Spice Girls, still love them now, and I'm still Baby Spice, like I always called everybody. Like, I told everybody I was Baby Spice. I am still Baby Spice, guys. Next, oh, I don't think I can show this. I'll show me. This is a little family picture it, from 1998, so I was, I think I was five again, three, four, five, yeah, five years old. I'm gonna cover everybody else up but me. Look, that's me. How cute is that? I literally had so curly blonde hair when I was little. That's so cute. I don't wanna show my whole family because I don't know if my sister will be happy with me putting baby pictures up of her. And also, my mum and dad don't wanna be online anyway. So yeah, that's why I've covered them up. Oh, the next photo is my baby, like my rabbits. How cute are these? These, obviously they're not alive anymore. But these are, Mopsy is at the front and Dottie is at the back. Dottie was only a baby. And Dottie, literally, she was so cute. So Mopsy died of old age, I'm pretty sure. And Dottie, we had a really like traumatic accident with Dottie. And Dottie actually fell out of the, his, her rabbit hutch and broke her back and had to get put down. But oh my God, that's so cute. I'm surprised Mipsy's not on there, but I don't think Mipsy was alive when Do we got Dottie. Mipsy was a white, sister rabbit to Mopsy. But yeah, so cute. I can't believe we've got pictures of them. That's so cute. Oh my God, I actually can't believe this. I was clearly obsessed with bunnies at this point, but <laughs> this is me in 1999. So that's three years, no, five, six. Yeah, I was six then. This is me with my little curly hair and all my little toy rabbits that I was clearly obsessed with. Can it focus, please? But yeah, I had such curly hair then, honestly. This was in school. This was in like, this must have been playgroup. I'm gonna cover like all the other kids at the back of them ones, so I'll cover these two out. But this is me on a little bike. I was literally so cute. I wish it would focus. I'm trying to like cover up everybody else. Me in the playground. How cute was I? My little curls. So cute. Oh my God. <laughs> I literally have the most wildest curly hair ever. But look, this is me in school. <laughs> so cute. Honestly. I look like I have such red eyes now because obviously it was like actual like cameras and the flash on there made your eyes go red and there was nothing you could do about it. Like you just had to deal with it. That's so cute. Right, next. <laughs> Somebody's jingling here and I don't know what it is. What is this? What is this piece of paper? It says, this is my best work. So this was really good. Oh, I've got writing on there as well. Oh my God, right. I am six years old. I have got, that's supposed to say brown eyes. I am very pale. <laughs> that is true. I have I've got a bit to focus. I don't know, but I've drunk myself and I look like an absolute clown on, clown on this picture. That is apparently me. <laughs> that is too funny. That is actually, I am Picasso. I am actually Picasso. Anyway, on the back it says, my something is 14 centimeters. I don't know what that says. My height is 18 centimeters. Surely not 18 centimeters. I wasn't that small. My head is 15 centimeters. My foot is 15 centimeters and my neck is 25 that makes no complete sense 
that means I've got a neck this big, a head this big, and I'm this tall. I don't know. Anyway, there's my handprint. <laughs> Who was measuring me at this point? I was definitely not this small. What the heck? Anyway, that's apparently some of my best work. I got, oh, that, that was in this, just saying my best work. Nothing else was on that. Anyway, next, let's dig in. What's this? Oh, this is what I remember. This is what I remember, right? Because I was so shocked that they let my, that my mum let them do this. I've got a bit of my curly hair in here. I would be mortified if someone cut my hair right now without my permission. Honestly, I'd be so mortified. So I've got a little lock of hair and a 20p and a 1p. I don't know what the 20p and the 1p is. Is it the years? 1993? What? Nah, I used to see the penny. No, that's 1998. That was the year I was born in. Oh my god, that's crazy. I've got a 20p and a 1p and they've not changed. They're exactly the same as what they are now. So we'll pop that back in. I, it's cute, but and it, look how blonde my hair is in that part compared to my hair now because this is natural. Anyways, next up, what we've we got in here. What is this? Oh my god, this is literally a map of where I lived. I'm pretty sure. Anyway, I'm not going to show that map, but this is a drawing of my house. I even put a Terence. Terence. <laughs> oh my god. This is apparently my house. It's a pretty good drawing, if I do say so myself. 22nd of the 10th, 98. My house. Everybody. Selling once, selling twice. And clearly that's just random pictures. Why do I always have motorbikes interrupting me? Anyway, that's a picture of my house. And I even got a golden star for that. So, pretty impressed with that. What's next? Oh, I drew a Christmas tree. Well, I drew. I, I did a Christmas tree. And I got a tick for it. I got a little tick. But yeah, this is a little picture of a Christmas tree I, I clearly put together. What's next? Oh, some schoolwork. This is me counting. I got every single one of them right. What a slot. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, okay. I drew a th three back to front. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five. I'm clearly missing a page. But I literally drew the three back to front. I've got all ticks on these. Look at that. I drew the three back to front. Icky. Other than that, I did really well with that. I got all ticks. Some cool little pieces. This is adding up. I was not the I'm not the best with maths, as you can clearly see on see on this. I didn't even complete complete the whole page because I clearly couldn't handle it. Adding in tens. Adding tens. All they did was was adding tens as well. I didn't do my best on this. This is apparently my best work as well. You can see, you can clearly pause to see that I did half of these wrong. And all I was doing was adding tens to the number. And I didn't even finish it because I'm so rubbish at maths. But this is apparently some of my best my best work. Right, so what's next? That just sums me up that I'm really not the best with maths. I don't know why they put that in there. Anyway, what's this? Why does it say Liam and Sarah? Who's Liam? I have no idea what this is. It says Liam and Sarah on the top. Who's Liam? 1999 again. This was just some tallying of how many sides the shapes had. I could say. That's a bit boring. Don't, that's not really, really, really good to see. Next. Oh, I've not got an all-out left. I've got a little letter now. Two letters, I think. Yeah, I'm nearly done now. Right, this is a piece of work that I've written some words. It says, a dog and a cat. The dog chased the cat and it didn't catch the cat. 
and the cat went home. Ben, no, the and dog. Oh my, I was doing so well. Something the dog put in the curve of the curve they were 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 re, re, re. cats were some cats were cats when in the cave that's the story by one and truly sarah me and it, it was the 1999 age five six I've said done this math so many times, this sums up my maths. 19, 19, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I would have been 6 because of the date. That is my story by Sarah, age 6. Next. I bet Mrs. Payne. Oh, Mrs. Payne was, I'm pretty sure she was a teacher in my school. Great grandma's time. Factory worker. Grandma's time. Oh my god. <laughs> Just see what's on the back. <laughs> oh dear. This is you're all gonna laugh at this, right? <sighs> so this on the 12th of the 4th, 99, but it looks like two P's because I wrote the nines backwards. It says, I want to be. Can you see that? I want to be a clown. I have no words. I have no words. <laughs> I want to be a clown. I genuinely want to be a clown. No, I don't, I'm scared of clowns. I clearly wanted to be a clown when I was little and I even drew a picture of a cl of Zed clown. I wanna be a clown guy. <laughs> what? I'm actually, I don't understand. What, I, I genuinely, if. I, I wish I could just like watch myself and see how I was as a kid. Like obviously I've got kid like videos and stuff, but surely I was very, very comical if I wanted to be a clown when I was little. That's what I wanted to be. I didn't achieve that. I work in optics instead. That's something that I didn't even think I would end up doing either. I'm so surprising. Anyway, I'm gonna pop this back together. This was very fun because I actually don't remember half of this stuff. Some of the stuff, I mean, I guess my mum could tell me what it actually meant because, especially that news article, I'm guessing that's just the date of like, just to prove that I'm that old. I actually can't believe that I wanted to be a clown when I was little, but hey ho. It is what it is. It's clearly my little dreams. Gone in complete opposite direction. Anyway. <laughs> So that was fun. I actually really enjoyed that. And I actually think I might try and find like my school reports and make this into kind of like a little series on my channel. But yeah, it was actually quite fun looking at, back at some stuff in this little time capsule. And I've not looked in here since, when did it tell me to? It's since 2009. So that was what? That was over 10 years ago clearly it's nearly been 20, 20 about 14 years ago was the last time i looked in that oh my god but that was really really fun i actually quite enjoyed myself filming this video but yeah so thank you guys for watching if this is something kind of that you like enjoyed watching let me know um because i can kind of make it a little series i actually think i'm going to either way but it was so fun i actually can't believe i really enjoyed this I'm still shocked at some of the stuff that was in there, but that was little me, and I can't believe that sock fits. The sock fits, guys. I actually can't believe it. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I know this is a little bit of a different video, but I, like I say, I enjoyed myself, and I hope you guys did too. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, let me know by giving it a thumbs up, and hit that comment section down. Hit the subscribe button even down below if you are new to this channel and let me know in the comments what you thought and if you would like me to kind of make this into a little series of looking back at like memories and stuff like that then let me know thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next week with another video bye